up everyone, Sean Cowboy Agrith here today with an album review, this time of the 2013 Zavard Records release of Sorrow and Skin by Scalpel. If you are not familiar with Scalpel, they are a brutal death metal band hailing from Massachusetts, and I gotta say, I absolutely love this band. This is my first exposure to them, and I cannot wait for what they put out next. Um... To begin with, where should I start? Uh, this is just an insane album. This is an album that will grip you from beginning to end. And this is an album that actually, right from the very start of the first track all the way to the last, I was hooked instantly. It's a very good album when it comes to songwriting and when it comes to creating memorable uh, soundscapes. Uh, I absolutely adore that about this album. Uh, another one of my favorite things about this also is just the ungodly heavy guitar tone that just cuts through like a knife. It will just beat your face in relentlessly. And it's just absolutely disgusting in every sense of the word. This is an album that makes me feel almost nauseated to listen to, and I love death metal that can do that to me. Um, another thing about this that's amazing is the drumming. The drums on this are just amazing. The dude is an absolute animal on the kit, and I cannot believe how fast this guy is. He is almost inhumanly fast. And that was something that almost bothered me at first, but the more I listen to it, the more I enjoy what he's doing, and I completely appreciate it. Um, my only complaint with the drums is I'm not too big on the kick sound. I wish it was a little deeper and a bit more bassier and less click, but it still works really well, especially for the speeds he's going. I understand you can't really have a muddy kick sound when you go the speeds that this guy does. Um, excellent bass tone, excellent bass work. Um, Vocals, powerful, absolutely powerful. Um, just some really, really strong, strong vocal lines and great lyrics. And just the sound of his voice alone just projected is incredible. You can tell he has a lot of power behind what he does. And then you get the backing vocals of the highs layered on top of the lows to create this really evil sort of sound and guys I'm loving this and I think you guys will too um I can't recommend this album enough it's just straightforward brutal death metal slash grindcore that uh excuse me death grind that you guys would like if you're a fan of it if you're not a fan of it it's not going to change your mind but this is some damn good stuff I'm feeling a very very strong 9 out of 10 on this um I will provide any links I can down below for you to check out, and uh, that's it, guys. Uh, just if you want some amazing brutal death metal, this album is definitely for you. I've cranked this so many times, guys. I you can't listen to this at a low volume. At least I can't. It's just absolutely disgusting. But that's it, guys. Um, very strong nine out of ten. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. And as always. Keep it metal.